Last time on Living Corpse... No, it's Mr. Game Guy Color. This time on Living Corpse... You know what, let's just go with it. What? <laughs> okay, that didn't happen. <laughs> Special thanks to Gabe Griffin for the idea. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> I put that in there. <laughs> da, da, da. That was cool, though. <laughs> I spent all night making that stupid thing. You better appreciate it! it. Josh Harder! Alright, let's go. Alright, let's fight again. Shock Man! Ow. <laughs> Attack. <laughs> Attack. Peck. Peck's magical. <laughs> Normal spell. Peck. And, uh, charge! Cause that's what dolphins do best! <laughs> Use pet 25 damage. Charge! Charge, 25 damage. Normal spell, 16 damage. Strangle, 20 damage. Yeah. 12 damage. Oh, cool, of course! Go for the dolphin! Take out the easy one, you douchebag! Take out the octopus! It's has over 100 critical hit. 31, 17, 12. Critical hit, 60, dead. Oh, well, he was easy! Well, I was about to say, no wonder he's a jerk. He's got a sh Never mind. Level 5, level 5. High five. Nope. I still got you. You got my... Gah! Uh, Ow! Oh, this bad If only my programming was better! Ugh. Why is this game so easy? Damn it! Dummy, now buzz off! <laughs> They're gonna hate our voices. Buzz off! Shark! Stubborn one, shall I hurt you more? <laughs> well, this character's a badass, so I give credit to this one. They just don't care. Hey! Stop, guys! <laughs> I'm not an idiot, so like you asked us, so I don't have to Jeez, what's idiot. the hold up, Wada? I mean, Shamey, he's. Hey, she's not an idiot like like Yosefire, so hey, I'm not gonna make her sound like an idiot. <laughs> Still so naive. Oh no. I knew it would come down Which to is this. exactly why you shouldn't be in this sea! Thanks, you jerk. Kids, uh, why? Dot, 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 dot. Come on. <sighs> Shimmy G. I think I said that right. You did it. Well, you better be gone some way or another. <sighs> dun, dun, dun. How the hell did he dun, swim? Dun, dun. Did he just swim like that? Dot, dot, dot. Don't tell me you're still. Ah, you're homeless! This guy is so. You're so out of his league! Or he's still Wait, out of league. Is she in love with him? Dun, dun, dun. I don't know. That hurts me. Why don't I hurt? I doubt it. He's a traitor. Oh, backstory. Ooh, so much going on, so much expense. Find out next time. And Peter and Josh against Wada Nohara in the Big Blue Sea. Uh, you know that too, don't you? I know it's the 50 minute mark, but we still got half a video to go. Damn! <laughs> I thought I got rid of this! Well, be there soon. Come on, everyone! Scary shark. <sighs> Scary shark. I don't like sharks. Me. I'm saying. Oh my god. Uh, I still I still can't believe I managed to pull off that title card. <laughs> I was just like, I'm sorry, what? What just happened? Oh god. <laughs> if you didn't notice that. Oh, sharks! For one, the horror sprite, though, I put the stupid dopey dot eyed face. I saw that, and I'm like, <laughs> why? And for the, and for but it made sense, too, with how what was going on. Yeah. And for the other guy. How the hell do you pronounce his name? Sam Kichi. Sam Kichi. For Sam Kichi, though, like first name, I put M. M. Dot Shark. As in oh, M. I Bison. didn't even see that. If I saw that, I probably would have been all like, eh, "This ain't real." <laughs> M. Dot Shark. What's that? This game is definitely sponsored by Capcom. Is that a lamp? Post? Please don't sue us. What the heck? Yeah. By the way, you didn't see it, but before there were crucifixes everywhere, and they don't do anything. By the way, this is. By the way, this guy in Japan though takes a lot of interest in the Christian into the Christianity. <laughs> maybe he's Christian. Maybe. Or maybe he's just doing it because of satire and other religions. I don't know. 
Well, hey, we don't know. We don't even know the person making this is a guy or a girl. It's, uh, it's a girl. I'm guessing maybe guy, but I can definitely see being. Oh, oh well, look, it's a gate. Hey, look, it's a pinnacle of rocks. I wonder if that's very suspicious, especially since it's in the middle of the sea. Hey, look, it's a crown. Yeah, the great blue sea, though, even though it stretches for, like, less than half the screen. Not the right way. No business this way. No business. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> oh, 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 Undertale would hate this game. If this was Undertale, you could go that way. If this was the new Zelda game, you this could go that way. If this was Undertale, there'd be a pacifist around, and you wouldn't kill that shark. You don't kill him. you just beat the crap. We wouldn't beat the crap. Return to boat, set sail, what's the difference? You actually get to walk on the boat. Oh, so then you can grab more magical candy. <laughs> uh, oh, I haven't told you this though. But apparently like, here though, like out of all of this guy or girl's works, this is like the most popular one. Like I know how popular it is. Yeah. It has its own manga. Manga. What? This has its own manga. <laughs> You're not gonna look that up. You're not looking that up. No, we're gonna lose our recording! I won't see you guys. <laughs> oh, what would horror you're back? I'm a crab with a spear. Oh, you need to click. Okay, I think it's W A D N O. Oh no, no A. In the Great Blue Sea manga. <laughs> Finally made it. Whew, feels like I'm really home. Yep. I can relax now. Relax. Don't know about that. Still might see Shark Boy. Oh no! <laughs> Did you think I was lying? Yes. All right, let's go home to the Sea Kingdom. Hey, at least it's not getting its own anime. I might. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> All right, I don't want to spoil myself. I'm not gonna look at that. <laughs> Oh, look. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> She's just there like, what? Uh, what? What? I'm just chilling. Oh, so Octopus Lady does have feet. Yeah. No, oh, look at the seagull. Yeah, and the, and the dolphin has like feminine shoes, so that's my... Yeah, Make I'm just sure chilling. you show this picture so that way they're not like, what? Look at this! Oh, God! <laughs> Why is it? Oh! This, I didn't tell you this, but this recording is a second take. This was the failed recording. It looks like this. Ugh. Hey, you know what? Hey, 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 you know what? It makes sense. I mean, after all, you're under the sea. Under the sea. Oh. Fishy, eh? <laughs> oh, look at that. These are cute. <laughs> oh, but they have tan skin. Oh, look at that. I love this music. It's like the credit. Hey, it's like the trailer music to Mogeko Castle Gaiden. Mogeko Castle Gaiden. Oh uh, yeah, they're making a sequel to Mogeko Castle. What the hell? <laughs> oh. You thought I was lying about the manga, did you really? Hey, remember him? No. Is he and Yosefire? Nope, he's not in there. He's just. Oh no, maybe it's a. Uh, no, it's not that guy. I can't even read this text. It's so, <laughs> so anyway, about the video, as Josh is looking up the one no horror manga, as well as all these characters. Oh, look at the cute Oh, there's the cute one! Ah. Uh, well, damn. Okay. We're acting, we're acting like a bunch of cute- we're acting like a bunch of fangirls, aren't we? Oh, God. That's hard on the eyes. Yeah, no, we are not acting like fangirls. We are acting like fanboys. Evers. I'm the Oh, have fun reading this text! Oh, Ew, it's one of Nohara! It's Illum Bahada. It's Illum Bahada. Who's Sam? Welcome back, one of Nohara! I'm fine, this is just longer than I expected. That's fine, she's just pretty leisurely herself! So you're so full, Florida. Oh, how is how it going over there? there? Stimulating! St stimulating! After a while in the water, we gotta, t we gotta talk like that. Yeah, lots of personality there. That's, That's nice. nice. I've never left the sea myself. You are jellyfish. 
Um, oh, how's, how's the, the kingdom? kingdom? You've you probably, probably heard, heard at least stories. Oh, the state of affairs doesn't look good. Which one is it? I'm going to the castle to tell you you're here. I call for you later. Can I just make one? Can I just make one criticism about this? There's a lot of typos. True. Why? I'm. I'm. This is just me nitpicking though, because this is just not my style telling a story. Why are there so many characters? Maybe you invested. I guess so, but I don't know. I guess I go by the Up formula. You remember that movie Up, Pixar? Yeah. And okay, I. I it's the one thing that Doug Walker said about the movie, though, and honestly, I truly stand by it. I like how the movie manages to tell good, manages to tell an evolving story, and yet it has so few characters. Duh. Yeah, but at the same time, with Up, it worked because they're in an event like in the Arizona. Mm -hmm. uh, with a story like this, where you're going across the entire sea and you're in a town and all, you're going to meet some few some different characters that you're going to remember. I guess that's true, but I don't know. This it's like that with real life. I guess that's I guess that's true, but I don't know. I guess if I were to write a story, though, I guess I would not make as many characters that you would have to remember though it's like okay not only this okay this is a laziness stuff but not only is it more worth for me to make the character it's more worth for the people to remember it well not only that but in the end you should really only make characters that you that you need yeah you don't need to make a character and give them a name and be all like oh hey well now i'll take you to this place and that's the end of that now, honestly that's what it feels like to me but i don't know you again didn't you listen to me you get my point yeah okay it's just my way though i'm not saying it's wrong or right my, uh, my game has at least eight main characters. Okay. If so I that way you can have a variety of your team hmm? members. Shimmy she? Yeah, there he is! Maybe we don't want to listen to your to the likes of you. Scary, scary shark again. Scary shark again. Okay, I'll, oh, no, not her, I'll do her. I'll to force you out. Okay. Why would you say that? Quiet, there's nothing I can say to you. Dot, 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 dot. Okay, those don't even look like dots. Hey, sharks, nuts, what are you saying to water? Yeah. How are you able to be in here, Sol, uh, Siegel? Insulting my master, are you? I can't forgive you. Scary shark. Hate. Hey, hey, hold on, on now. Wait. Wait. Did that say now? What that said? Roar. Hey, bring it on. Again. Okay. Maybe he's tougher. Uh, uh, maybe. Maybe he has like 10 more HP. Uh, 13. 17. Well, we're already fighting 17. this guy again. That was Maybe awfully That was awfully Is this supposed to be a good show? It's supposed to be a good enough game for a secondary anime? <laughs> yeah, we're fighting the same guy already. Even though we have like 600 people we can use. Why don't we put the witch person to the lobster? That would be a cool boss fight. <laughs> no, 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 don't do that. Oh, lord. I love the sound effects. Good God! Yeah, I, I do not know how to pronounce this. Just go auto. Just go uh, auto. F, look how much HP F has. That's it. Game over. Game over. Well, I guess. Yeah. Well, I gotta say, we're more invested into this though, because you know, there's actually stuff happening. Oh, oh there we go. You did it. I think that's two hundred. C yeah, spell. You learned C spell Sh and shout. Shout snarl. Bear. Octopot? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I would. I had to. Uh, damn it. Damn Street Fighter! I can't Street Fighter! Pathetic. Pathetic shark, dummy shark. Dummy shark. Guys, stop it, I said! You, you're nothing but an impediment for me. <laughs> it's hard to read, guys. There is a he's really great on me. Guys, you should stop being so cool. What, uh, what are you doing? We're doing this for you, kiddo. Know? Why do they all have the same voices? <laughs> That's you're what I'm really saying. Tired. Let's return home. Dot, 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 dot. Well, we've been recording for an hour. How does it feel? Well, we're halfway there. More than halfway, actually. 
So, what do you think about this game so far? I think the quality needs to go up. <laughs> it's hard to read. Thank God we have good eye vision. No, we don't. Well, you should have brought your characters. Well, your carrots. Least, well, at least I do. It's because you eat too many carrots. Well, maybe you probably have good eye vision. Yeah, you do. I have perfect 40-50 vision. I mean, after I mean, after all, you are under the sea, so it makes sense. It'll be hard to see. I have perfect 40-50 vision. Nothing's hard to see. But don't worry. Deep sea town. Don't worry. Is this... Deep sea town. There hey, you go! it's better! Here we are! Yeah. Yep. Wow, deep sea town! It's been too long! Tubby, not big. Oh, Wait. that was my fault. Okay! Rumble. Watch, one of those characters are secretly evil. I think it's Dolphy. Yeah, definitely. I Dolphy. think Dolphy is uh, Samakichi, and I think Samakichi is actually Dolphy. Can't believe this, girl. No wonder I hate one Ugh. So what the? What should, what should I do? Uh, damn it! Oh, if only let's I could go grab a hot dog. I heard they're tasty with mustard. Yes, they are. Why is my voice so deep and scratchy? Awful timing. Maybe I would stop swimming in the ocean. Oh, Absolutely. Dot, 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 dot. He agrees with you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I need my own boat. I hate Wamadahara. Can't believe it's all. God, this is bad. Where the hell's my boat? You stole my boat. Shark Man needs his boat. I'm sorry, I gotta stop spinning. Whatever it takes. Dot, 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 dot. I, I have to. Hey, at least this has some depth. Great Garden was just goofy. Great Garden was literally just apples. Munch, munch, munch. Tastes good. good. Yeah. <laughs> it looks more like it's horrible. Good stuff. Good job, everyone. For what? Good job, me. Good job, Mimoka. You should rest yourself. Well, I thought I would say hi to everyone first. Hi. hi. Wanna? I can't wait for later. You gotta eat first. Okay, this character's clearly the know-it-all. Yes, you should rest. And I'm the wise one. Oh, I'm fine, guys. I'm just the she innocent one. She's the oblivious innocent one. Really? Yeah. She <laughs> wants with that face. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, I, 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 shut up. You must really love that face, because every time it pops up, you stop the text. <laughs> 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 uh, you seriously must love this face. Yeah, yes, I do. I love it. It's so simple, and I love it. Well, if Waddle, much, much. Who the hell is Dolphy supposed to be then? I don't know. The scary child that everyone thinks is adorable. Yeah, I don't know. The delusion. Don't push yourself too far. I don't know. I guess the innocent one. <laughs> I'm stuck. But by the way. A penny of Juan Mahara's far. I actually cut this out from the video, but um, it was at this point where I actually closed the laptop while it was still recording, so it actually froze and there was like a bunch of static and stuff. Ooh. But I uh, I took that out though because I didn't want to ruin the video. But that was in the original recording. There would be like a bunch of staticing and stuff. And All of a sudden, Ben drowned. <laughs> Creepy pasta galore. Yeah, Juan Mahara is secretly the Ben drowns victim. She secretly is Ben. Tasty snacks. Jeez, so serious, Wada. Munch, munch. Why so serious? And now here's the moment where I wander around the town wondering, what the hell do I do? Oh, great. Ugh. No, actually, it's okay. I only cut out, I only, I only showed them the important parts. The rest was all cut out. The drawer contains lots of pictures. The picture John title, the writing back, so messy it's unreadable. <laughs> That's a fire-breathing fish. Genius! <laughs> a picture wrongly drawn by Fukimi. It's titled Shark Grill. No, that's pretty cool. That's, that looks tasty. That's pretty good, actually. Dolphy. Everyone! Oh, Oh, that's adorable. I want to know if this guy actually, or girl, actually drew this. <laughs> Wait, by Memo Cuts. Titled <laughs> Memo Cuts. <laughs> I want to know if this person actually drew this a long time ago, and then they're like, finally showing, finally putting these on. Like, they drew this, like, years ago. Mm. I would laugh. I, so. I would laugh if that was the case. 
Well, maybe it's like a case of evil where they purposely made it look bad. Maybe. Well, you know, the, you know the crown world. Yeah, it looks very childishly drawn. Mm-hmm. That guy who made that game never really made anything after that. Huh. Well, I don't know what happened. Well, that's because he was a one-hit wonder and he knew it. It's like he game. didn't want to make anything that would be. He didn't want to make another game because he knows it'd never be as good as he. It's like he's really popular. Damn it, I failed. <laughs> I can't make another game. Uh, I love how there's bubbles everywhere. A bet. Take a rest. I'm gonna take a bit of the octopus. There. Okay, the octopus said to. So there you go. Yeah. Dead. Take another no, rest. No, not not dolphins. Gotta do it on all beds. Not dolphins. Maybe metal goes. Oh. Oh. Ow. 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 A spare hat. And I'm and I'm a spare like. Hat. And I'm like the Grey Garden, I am not kissing the screen like I did last time. Did I tell you that one time I kissed the screen? Why? Because I'm just being a dork. This reminds me of the time. A music box. Hey, it's Mario in the music box! Oh god. That's actually an RPG horror. Mario Mario in the music box. I know, and it's horrible. Well, you don't like it? Well, no, I mean, it's like, it's good. It's As a few clever jump scares here and there. But you just don't like it. I, I think they shouldn't have made it a Mario fan. <laughs> Especially because it's done in the Mario in the Mario character design. However, it's however its animation is great, and so is the voice acting, even though they pretty much just copped it. Cropped it. Alright, I'll look around. Yeah, no kidding. See, I only show the important parts. <clears throat> what the? Is that the Mr. Saturn of this game? I guess so. Before it was someone else. Oh! Like Tango Seat Takara. Takarona. Terako. Terako. What in the horror? You're back! Yep! Was it okay? Did you get any accidents? No, it was fine. Ooh, I was worried. I was spending a lot of ink while you weren't around. Great! Oh, I know. How about I do it now? Hmm, I'll pass. Really? Maybe later. Right. Oh, yeah, earlier. I saw. Blah, blah. Senkichi. Eh? You seem really fidgety. But, oh, I see. Maybe it was because you were back. Ah, uh, I see. Hmm, Bowman Hara won the side face. Well, I met him earlier, too. Oh, he's just shy, and he won't admit it. Some of difficult. You think so? Yes, I do. I proclaim so. Huh? What? He's not difficult. It is he's so. Easy to beat. Oh. Heh, thank you, whatever. Good, good. Because you're my friend. Yeah! I'll give you proof of friendship. Oh, you kisses! I might pass on that. Oh, too bad. Why does nobody like my Oka kisses? It's Octo. Octo kisses. <laughs> Please don't kiss me. I would There's a Mogaku. I would read There is a Mogaku. <laughs> I would read this one. Please. Please. There is a Mogaku <laughs> playing the trumpet and it says jazz. Actually, that's just a trumpet Mogeko. The trumpets are actually stuck in a mouse. What? That's the actual exclamation, I'm not kidding. <laughs> it's containing its great treasures. What the? Wait, 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 wait. Toys. Wait, look at that. It's a snail and turns to a board. And then wow, turns it does that for everything. And then it turns into an Othello board. Which, by the way, yes, I know that's Othello. My great guard played through, I said it's something stupid! Jeez. <laughs> Octokiss! <laughs> yeah. In, in GG, there's an Othello board, and I kept saying Octocrap. Oh, hey, the shop! I brought this so we could argue about what the hell I'm buying! Life preservers, seedweed soup, shijimi, shijimi snack, sea grapes, coconut juice, mango. Shijimi, what the heck is shijimi? Ow. Don't look it up. What were you gonna Google it on your piece of equipment over there? Hello, everyone. I am Mr. Game Guy Color. Now, you are probably thinking, why am I stopping the audio or the video or halting it at this current point? Now, the reason why, though, it's because, though, it was around at this point, though, after I, Josh decided to go look up the Sajimi, that our audio actually just randomly cut off, though. We have no idea why it cut off, though, but um, my theory, it, it's because, though, is that Audacity, the program we were using to record our voices, my guess is that maybe it was just wasn't made, though, to take over... 70 long 70 minute long recordings though and we were we at that point though we were filming though basically or not filming i'm um, recording over an hour 
and 40 minutes of continuous recording audio footage. So I'm guessing maybe Audacity just couldn't take it that long, though, and still keep recording, though, for how loud we were, though, and just how crazy we were. So it probably would have been a better idea if we just did it in cuts rather than do it in one long session, though. But whatever. So due to that, we were only be able to we were only able to get the 70 minutes from the video. The 30, the next 30 or 20 minutes or so, it's gone, which is, in my opinion, very unfortunate though, because it was at that point that we were started. We weren't even paying attention to the game at that point. We were just going on though about Deep Sea Predator though, and then we were going on Google. We were looking up all the individual characters. We were looking up, though, his different series, though. We were looking up about different things about it, though. We were basically just goofing off at that point. So that's basically what happened on the next 25 minutes, though, that we lost of this recording. So I guess to make up for that, though, I'm just going to do the next 25 minutes on my own, basically just, you know, recap and, I guess, familiarize on what's going on, though, since, well, I'm recording this way after we did the original recording. And I guess just to... And I guess until then, though, we're just going to keep going on, though. Don't worry, the next video, though, will have both me and Josh in it, though. We just, this was just a very unfortunate thing that happened, though. And we have learned since then to do our recordings in sections rather than just full hour-long recordings, though. Because we've lost audio recordings before, and we had no idea how that happened. So, with that being said, I guess I might as well answer the question that Josh was looking at Sajimi, though. I looked it up quickly, though. It actually is just a shellfish that is usually made in Japanese course, courses or dishes or servings. Basically, a food that is eaten in Japanese culture. So, that's what Sajimi is, though, to answer the question to anybody that was confused about that. But regardless, I'm just going to stop it right here, though, and I'm going to continue on the video, and I'll see you guys in just a few seconds. See ya! Okay, we are back, and we are back at the point, though, where I'm back in the shop, though, <laughs> looking for more items to buy and more arguing to be pursued. <laughs> okay, now I should probably be a bit more exhilarated, though. Okay, we only have 20 minutes to go. Anyway, so it was at this point, though, where me and Josh were basically just going on and doing our fake arguing on whether or not, though, by, well, on what items to buy, though, or what items we should rely on, <laughs> of course, since that's what we did in the garden bonus video though where we just went over all the passwords I did though just kept arguing. Hey, I guess you can kind of think of the series as a continuation of, of that bonus video. But whatever. So anyway guys, how have you guys been doing though? I've been doing pretty well actually. Oh, it's at this point where we meet more minor characters. I'm just gonna skip over that. You guys can read. You guys can do your silly old voices yourselves. Ugh. But I guess while we're at this point, though, I might, be, I might as well just be going over the current situation with me and Josh and whether or not we're going to be able to do more of these. Now, first things off, though, at this current moment, I am currently recording this, um, this current footage on August 30th, so <laughs> more than, um, almost a quarter, so we're about three quarters of the year through, and, um, as of now, though, ever since then, we have recorded only three parts of Wabanahara and the Great Blue Sea. Uh, don't worry, though. Um, I know I'm really bad at uploading schedules, though. The first part I think I uploaded, I think, three months ago, and now I'm finally uploading the second part. Um, during, during that three-month lifespan, though, me and Josh also recorded another video, though. We recorded the, um, we recorded a video on his channel, and we recorded another session of the third part of Malbin Hard and the Great Blue Sea. Now... So with, that, so with that being said, though, I wanted to make a much more fluid schedule, though, since it's over the summer. We were both done with high school, though, so we thought we would have more time, but nope, we just don't. We just did not have enough. We just did not have enough time, though, to go out and do more recording, unfortunately. But, oh well. I guess I should just mention, though, just one last thing, though, but I'm very bad at transitioning into sentences by myself, which is why I'm doing these solo recorded sessions, so I can be better at it. <laughs> Anyway, anyway, though, um, I know I'm completely ignoring the video, but anyway, um, Josh said, um, recently, Josh recently moved away, though, he moved away to a different town, um, still in my state, and still in within driving distance, though, but, um, he's gonna be busy, though, since he went off to college, though, so he's gonna be a lot more busy, and even though he already was busy beforehand, though, it's gonna be, I'm guessing, significantly just as difficult to get him to be able to record, like the previous times though because I let me tell you I've wanted to record a lot with Josh though we just never had the time though since either one of us were usually busy at that point which was really unfortunate but not anymore at this point 
well, <laughs> not anymore at a, at a small section though where we got to record the third part, but whatever. So uh, anyway, so I guess I should just be saying though that I, my original goal for recording the series though, which um, I don't remember how many of these parts I've recorded though, I think I've recorded roughly six or seven, but case in point, my original goal for this project though, which, you know, I guess you can call it a let's play, I guess you could just call it a commentary, I guess you can just call it a bad dub series though, I don't know, I guess I wouldn't classify it as a let's play since, you know, the deep, since I made that filler video though where Deep Sea Prisoner actually this is a base, oh, by the way, the face. Where Deep Sea Prisoner, though, actually, um, crap, what's the term, though? I guess disapproves of you doing playthrough videos, though. Which, I've said before, though, I, I've i done two, I've done uh, playthrough videos on other Deep Sea Prisoner's other games, though, but I did not know at the time that he disapproved, or she disapproved, of doing Let's Play videos of the games at the at this point. But... But the reason why I'm doing let's why I'm doing essentially a let's play on this game though, um, well I <laughs> I'm gonna be honest I basically just threw in the towel and just said screw it though I just I went for broke I said screw it though I said you know what they're probably never gonna find out this playthrough ever exists there's very little harm that can probably come out of me actually filming this and putting this out though there are many other people who've gone out and done and filmed this game and put it out though and did their own playthroughs of it i'm not sure exactly sure what's the harm of me doing it though now i know that's probably a very bad thought process or a very bad way of approaching the sort of the sort of subject sorry, sort of subject i really need to learn to speak a lot better i should probably go to a speech therapist but anyway so I basically, I just said, you know what, screw it, I'll do this game, though, just for the hell of it, because I wanted to do it. But I've also but I've also made a little proclaim for myself that, um, because I don't want to push my luck, and I don't want to disrespect the original creator, though. Because despite, because, you know, despite me doing this playthrough, though, basically, you know, disobeying what they said in, on not doing playthroughs, though, I, I still did this, though, um... What the hell was I going with that point? Oh, okay. So, despite me basically disobeying them and doing a Let's Play video on this game, though, after finding it out, though, because before I did not know when I did Mogeko Castle and the Grey Garden, but I just decided to keep those videos up, though, because, well, no one seemed to have a problem with it. So, I'm... So, okay. My main point is, despite me disobeying them and doing a Let's Play on this, after knowing about it, I am not going to be doing any more Let's Play videos on any more of Deep Sea Prisoner's games. I'm not going to be doing any more full Let's Play videos, though. So any games that the creator makes in the future, I am not going to be doing. I will be making videos on what I thought of those games, though. Just to, I guess, give you some insight, though, on what I thought about the games, though. But I'm not going to be doing full Let's Plays like I did with Mulgeko Castle and the Great Guard. So this will essentially just be sort of my last only, though. I guess it will be sort of a... I don't know, I guess sort of a Deep Sea Prisoner trilogy, if you want to go by that terminology. So, um, yeah, that's my... I guess to wrap that whole thing up, though, I will be doing... I will... This will be my last game. And, oh, hey, look! <laughs> it's these four. I do not remember what we said in the original recording. I think we just said, though, oh, hey, look, it's the... <laughs> it's the Wabanahara version of Yosefire and her gang from the Grey Garden, though. Only, you know, waterfied. So that's what we said in the original recording. We were just goofing off though and saying, "Oh, hey, look! It's it's what it's this it's their count it's this game's counterpart of that gang. Only they're not the main characters." Well, I mean, I'm not exactly sure. I guess they could be. I guess they may not be. I mean, you know, the main one's all red though, and she's kind of a kind of a kind of a ditz though, and kind of a energy holic though. So whatever. So anyway, that's I guess that's the whole solution. The whole solution though, and the whole situation that not many people are probably gonna hear. But hey, if as long as one person hears about this, then, well, I think I got my time for it out of this. But um, anyway, I guess back to the game. These four are arguing about, there's treasure over here. It's like, no, there's not treasure over here. What? There totally is treasure there, though. You know, I have no idea how to pronounce her name, though, because, you know, Josh knew how to pronounce in the, in the original recording, but I don't. Since Josh is way better at um, pronouncing Japanese names, though, than I am. <laughs> Your fault. So you can thank him for that. If anybody's seen any of my previous videos, they know I'm terrible at that, but oh well. It's nothing that's set in stone. I can improve, but oh well. Coral path. You know what? I really don't even care. I don't care either. None of us cared. None of us cared at all. But yet it's still the case. 
Found them, found my glasses. Oh, in my uh, old recording, though, back when, with the bad... He, you already saw with the one I did two recordings on this game, and this one is the second one. In the original one, if you talk to that fish, though, he said, I can't find my glasses. And then you talk to the gang, though, and then talk to him again, though. He'll say, oh, I found my glasses. So, you know, small development changes. Anyway, here we are in this house, though, to a future character with a... What is that, a girl? What is that, a schoolgirl uniform? Well, I guess just a uniform. A school uniform? I guess not... I guess schoolgirl's not the correct term, but whatever. Just some kind of uniform. I don't know, maybe Girl Scout. Something like that. So, here we are at this moment. I know I'm not the best at doing these post-commentary things. And, oh, I remember this section. <laughs> A book about lobsters. A book on lobsters. A lines of books on lobsters. Lines of with books on lobsters. Line with books on lobsters. Line with books on lobsters. More books on lobsters. So many books on lobsters. And hey, look, a giant lobster. <laughs> I remember in the original one, though, Josh was freaking out. Like, oh my god, that is a big as hell lobster. How the hell did they even get that thing in there? That's my question. I'm just so worried. No, I'm not going to be reading the dialogue. You guys can read the dialogue. You don't need to hear our terrible voices. <laughs> So, what else should I go on about? Hmm, I, can, I guess I can go on about what's else on the news. Huh, so what else do I have in news, though, and what else do I have in news for the future? Wow, that made completely no sense, but whatever. What else do I have planned for the future? Well, at this moment, though, you guys don't know I'm doing the uh, Desolated Hope playthrough, though, on one of Scott Cawthon's old games, though. If anybody doesn't know, Scott Cawthon is the creator of Five Nights at Freddy's, and De the Desolated Hope is one of the games he made before that, though, so that's where he sort of got his programming experience, though, and I guess solidifies with some of the games he made, though. But anyway, I decided to play that, though, on my channel. Not exactly sure how it's going on so far. I'm not. I don't think it's turning out very well, though. But hey, I. I. At this point, though, I've recorded the third part, and the third part, in my opinion, has turned out much better than the first and second part, though. So hey. I also should know that I have no idea how long that playthrough is going to be, though, because unlike um, the first four, unlike um, E Witch's House and Mogeko Castle, I have which were games I played beforehand. I just pretended like I didn't know them, though, just to make it interesting. The Desolated Hope is a game I have not played before, though, as well as Ayana Oni and The Great Garden. These, and Wabin Nahar and The Great Pussy, these are all games I did not play, though. So I have no idea how long The Desolated Hope is going to be, though, considering it's a quite different game from these RPG maker games I usually play. And, well, there was that one game, game maker game, though, um, Whiskers, which, was Whiskers Game Maker? Oh, something like that. Anyway, oh my god! What was that sound? I have no idea! That way! So yeah, so something's happening in the story, but anyway. So back to the Desolate Hope. I'm currently playing the Desolate Hope. My current goal, though, is to finish that. Because I am currently... Because I have a few more days though, before I have to sign up for classes, though, and go back to college. Hmm, heard a loud sound. What was that sound? Hold on, I gotta read this. This is funny. Z... I really don't care, but what was that noise? That's my favorite line as of now in the game. That is probably my favorite line. Uh, and Anyway, though, so going back to what I was saying, I'm very inconsistent with this. I have no idea how long the Desolated Hope is going to take, though, but I do plan on finishing it before the end of the year, though. And I have no idea when I'm going to be able to record it or finish it, though, or what I have to show off, though. Because, like I said before, I'm going, to, I'm going to have to sign up for classes soon. I'm going to be going back to college. I'm going to be taking college part-time, though, which means I'm not going to have the most time to record. And not to mention, I do all my recording sessions when my mother's out of the house. Mainly because we live in a small house, though, and whatever she does, though, always attracts noises. And, well, <laughs> she always has something to say about me talking to myself, though. But, oh well. Anyway, so, um, that's the whole scoop, though. As for Wabanahar and the Deep Blue Sea, um, whether or not, though, on how long I think this is gonna last, um, for the most part, and I've already said this in part three, though, so I guess it's kind of redundant, though, to say this now, though, but regardless, though, um, I've recorded around... Whoa, I do not remember what happened at that point. Oh, yeah, that's right, I put it in the window. Um... As for the Wabanahar and the Great Blue Sea, I would like, I wanted to initially finish this before the end of the year, though, but considering our situation that we did not, I, because, considering our current situation with Josh going to college, though, and with me going to college, I have no idea if we're going to have free time or not, though, and there's also the, the simple fact that I have to get my license and I have to, well, drive over to where he is in order to be able to record. 
<sighs> so I have I have no idea if I'm able if I'm gonna be able to finish this in time though by the end of the year though I'm guessing probably not but oh well because at this current point though I have I um have over seven parts currently like I have the footage for the game seven parts of the footage though currently recorded but I need the actual audio commentary and notice how I said seven parts though I am actually not done recording all the footage for the game though I'm at the in my, from my understanding, around the final climax of the of the of the game, though, like the final, I guess, last ten percent, though, like the final confrontation of the game, or the last section, I'm at where I think where the final confrontation takes, though. So my my plan for that, though, is that I'm going to record that live with Josh, so when we're going to see that we're going to see that blind for as our first reaction for the first time to make it interesting rather than just me knowing what happens and you know he you know gets all and you know he gets all shocked like oh my god what happens and i already know it though so i'm doing it to make it more interesting though so we both figure out that when we both get shocked for seeing the rest of the story because i've seen most of the story but josh has only seen up to part three but whatever i should probably also note though for part three though we actually had a very unexpected thing happen to us though which by the way flapjacks i love that name I have no idea if those, um, animal- I don't know- I have no idea if those animals actually exist, and if they actually are called Flapjacks. I should probably look that up, though, but oh well. Anyway, for part three, though, we had something kind of unexpected happen that you're gonna be noticing in part three, though. If you haven't already skipped this section and went to part three. But, um, anyway, in part three, though, um, we had a funny incident happening, though, where we were recording a video beforehand. And before we got- before we had the chance to finish that recording, though, before we initially had to finish the chance, uh, one of Josh's other friends actually came to his house, though, because he thought- because he- because he thought, though, Josh, um, because Josh, um, called him in to hang out, though, but Josh forgot that he was coming that day, so he showed up unexpectedly, though, at the door, though, and we let him in, though, he's like, hey, what are you guys doing, though, while in the middle while we were recording, though, <laughs> so that was kind of funny, though, and- just for the heck of it, though, for the third episode of Wabanahar and the Great Blue Sea, we decided to introduce him <laughs> for the third part. So, so, I guess if I guess if he's completely okay with it, um, Blaze, Josh's friend, though, is joining us in the third part of Wabanahar and the Great Blue Sea. So he's gonna be a little special guest for the third part. And I guess I should also note, though, that when Josh went off to college, though, Blaze is also going with them. So, hey, if both of them are not busy, though, we might, I might be able to get both of them, though, for the rest of the series. Who knows? <laughs> but anyway, that's our current situation, though, with the whole Wabba Nahar and the Great Blue Sea thing. We got it. We got a special guest for the third part, though. I am, I kind of doubt we're going to get a special guest for anything later on, but oh well. And I think it would be kind of a miracle if we got Blaze. I mean, I guess it's not really a miracle or unexpected if we got Blaze to be in the rest of the parts, but whatever. <laughs> hey, if you've seen part three already, though, or if you skip this section to see the part three, or maybe, hell, maybe if you haven't seen part three and you're actually listening to this, though, um, please expect, please be prepared and expect Blaze. Please like him. I, I don't know about you. I found him very entertaining. His commentary was very riveted. But anyway, here we have a serious section, which I should probably pay attention to. What? Oh, wait, I, I, do, I, do I do the voices? Oh, what in the horror, bad news! <sighs> Please, calm down! Kill, kill them all! Certainly something went down. I, I, I skipped the text so far. <laughs> Screw it. Never forgive, never, never the ones who deserve or see moral fiber or nothing. All of them will die! Ah, 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 I. <laughs> I'm having Mary syndrome. Hey, hell... He got calm down. I have no idea what the hell this is going. I'm skipping the text too fast. Damn it, past me and my quick test. Uh, anyway, Helkaya, Helkada, something like that. Whatever. It's a boss fight. An overly enraged character. You don't see that very often. I should also probably note though that um, I'm <laughs> I'm listening to this point with no uh, audio though, since I don't want it to go over the microphone though. But there is audio, as you guys can clearly hear. Well, from the game, but whatever. <laughs> I think it was just at this point where I was making a comment to Josh, though, saying that the music did not fit the boss fight or the situation whatsoever, but whatever. You guys can figure that out, your point. <laughs> Snarl. What's up with all these verbal-based attacks? I didn't think verbal-based attacks were very threatening, but oh well. She attacked with her giant drill from that one anime that I forgot Josh 
I don't know, I forgot what the anime Josh brought up was. It was some... It was that one anime where the characters use a giant drill or something like that. I don't, I don't remember what it was. <laughs> I'm sure somebody can tell me. The nobody watching. <laughs> Strangle. Charge. Seriously, how the heck do you pronounce your name? Heck... Hel... Helketa? Helkada? Helkada? Helika? Helika? Heliki? Helika? Something like that. It's it, something around those terms. And oh my god, Dolphy's almost dead. I must be concerned. No, don't worry. <laughs> wow, I actually used a healing spell. If I learned anything from the Great Garden, I should know that any deep sea seasoner, <laughs> e deep seasoner, <laughs> deep sea prisoner game that has RPG combat in it, it's that the combat in all deep sea prisoner games that have combat are incredibly easy. Which, at, the, at this point, though, is the Grey Garden and Wabin Han and the Great Blue Sea. But whatever. I heard Mokeko Castle, though, actually had, um... It actually, like, in the original version, it had combat, though, but it was cut out, though, because it wasn't really fitting and it kind of sucked. But whatever. Anyway, <laughs> despite all that build-up, she died. Yeah, he didn't know, though, I played, um... I played Mokeko Castle... Is that the version of Mokeko Castle I played was an uh, updated version, though. And I never actually played the old version because it was Japanese only. Hmm? <laughs> It was never translated. So whatever. I still would have played the new version because the new version was the one I was familiar with. My maid squeeze your back. Dot, 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 dot. Did I do it again? Yes, you did. That's our Helkata. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Sorry, I just... Dang, dude. There. I'll, I'll, do, I'll do Mevokoa's very not fitting voice at all. <laughs> Why do, why do, why do we subject, why do we subject ourselves to these horrible voices? I don't know, I don't care, it's, it's what we do best, because we are very, very silly people. But, oh well, the video's almost over, we got a minute left. Exactly, actually. I should probably really be focusing the text, but I am not focusing the, on the text at all. But, oh well, I don't want any more conflict. It's okay, Wada. I don't want any more conflict, too. Oh, hey! It's... Sibikichi! I think I said his name right! I don't... I don't. I didn't say his name before right, though, but now I do. I, th I think I said it right. Josh, please, if you're watching this, tell me if I'm right. Uh, future Josh, please tell me. A text future annotation Josh, please tell me. Did I say that right? Please, I, I don't want to make a fool of myself. Please don't kill me. I should also probably be more consistent with making these videos and speed the hell up on my dilemma, whatever. Couldn't get much sleep. They slept? They sleep in this time period? <laughs> no, they probably do. Nothing to freak out over. Aw, oh, the cute smile. Well, anyway, here we are at the end of the recording, though. Well, with that being said, it was fun doing the recording with you guys, so I'll see you guys, well, me, Josh, and Blaze will all see you in the next episode. So until then, you guys have a good day. See ya!